pretty obvious which one has the neck stiffness and possibly a swollen thyroid. But what's less obvious is why that even matters with meningitis. Well, in meningitis, because of viruses or less commonly bacteria, the layers around the brain and the spinal cord become inflamed. Around the neck, those layers are particularly mobile and when they become inflamed, that also irritates the nerves. So as we move the neck, it causes the muscles there to spasm as a reflex. We call that mucal rigidity, but it isn't the only symptom of meningitis as it can also be associated with a fever, light sensitivity, a severe headache, and even a rash on the skin with specific types of spots. That is a rash that does not go away when a glass is held up against it, which usually indicates a bacterial type of meningitis, but thankfully we're seeing this less and less commonly because of the newborn vaccination schedule. But still, recognizing the symptoms of meningitis to get treated early will help to protect your brain from any complications.